Our chicken meat may soon be sold here in packaging made from the chicken's own feathers. Oh, that's part of efforts by Nanyang Technological University and poultry producer Leong Hupt to create a zero-waste processing facility. Neuron Wei with more. They are one of the largest poultry players in the region, processing about 50,000 chickens daily. But not all parts of the bird can be sold, and disposing of them properly can cost up to a million dollars a year. At this facility, about four tons of chicken feathers are bagged and burnt each day. But now, researchers have found a way to squeeze out useful materials from them, process them and turn them into products like trays. They are made greener by replacing petrochemical-based plastics with keratin, a type of protein found in the feathers. The company hopes to roll out this greener packaging by year-end. We are targeting a couple of months from, from, uh, from now, of course, uh, and this is just a started, starting project. We are very excited and of course we are looking at if everything is uh, in line as what we've been uh, arranged, hopefully we can push out into the industry as soon as possible. But first, they'll need to work closely with NTU to simplify and scale up the process. To extract keratin, feathers are sterilized, ground up for hours and then mixed with polyester resin into a plastic-like material. But their road to zero waste is paved with more than chicken feathers. The company is also collaborating with NTU on the use of chicken blood as a more affordable component to cultivate cell-based meat. The phytopoan serum costs about $2,000 per litre and uh, the chicken blood that is to be discarded comes at almost no cost. So we are really looking at a huge improvement. And then there's chicken poop, which both partners are exploring for use as biofuel. If everything goes according to plan, this collaboration could be the first zero-waste poultry processing facility in the country.